So Gearbox just dropped a patch which nerfed the pipe bomb, fixed the negative guardian tokens bug and a few other bits. Today we test the waters of the patch. How's it going guys? My name is DPG and I'd like to thank you for stopping by and checking out the video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps out and subscribe if you want more Borderlands 3 videos. Also, I am giving away copies of Borderlands to win one for yourself or a friend. Simply subscribe and make sure you have notifications turned on. Drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below. Okay, so the patch notes Gearbox Drop stated they were fixing a few issues. Today, I want to concentrate on said fixes and see how they have affected the game we play. Firstly, the vending machines put in rarity order under the item of the day is an amazing quality of life update. I absolutely love it. I can also confirm the porcelain pipe bomb does nothing but tickle grave ward now. Yep, they have definitely nerfed this thing. And the negative guardian tokens bug many people were having seems to have been fixed in terms of them putting everybody back to a zero. I took it upon myself to go offline to check if the issue can happen again, so that's what I did. I loaded into Borderlands offline in my favourite XP farming spot, and although XP was definitely increased, I wasn't getting the initial 30, 40 or 50 plus levels I'd normally get from that first kill while playing offline. Another thing I did check out also was, can we now farm XP as it is increased offline without running the risk of going into negative once we head back online. So I farmed 6 additional guardian tokens while offline and earning that offline XP, and then I spent said tokens. What I then did was quit out of the game and load it back up. What I noticed was that guardian tokens I did use didn't actually count towards any of my guardian rank percentages, adding nothing to the stats. Although at the time they were definitely applying additional percentages, once I quit out and loaded back in, I was back to where I started without the guardian tokens. And also looking back on the video now, which I didn't notice at the time, my guardian rank wasn't going up either. So it seems as though the way that you fix this is, if you farm XP offline and spend said tokens, they ain't added to your guardian rank and once you quit out and load it back up, you get reverted stats wise back to square one where you started. And you know what I mean, this is a much better fix than the negative token, so fair dues. With changes being made to offline gaming, I thought I'd go ahead and check out offline legendary farming also, and people, it still works. You still get way more legendaries playing offline than what you do online. So that's cool. So we can still offline farm legendaries if you wanna. It's just farming offline XP. Absolutely pointless. So yeah guys, I just wanted to test the waters with this latest patch and let you guys know the results I found. And on that note guys, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leave a like, it really helps out. If you're new around here and wanna see more Borderlands 3 videos, be sure to subscribe. And if you never wanna miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next. One.